Hello again, this is Property Matters on Bloomberg UTV. Now, time and time again on this show, we've been speaking about green homes and sustainable technology. But what do you make of a home that consumes absolutely no energy? That's right, zero energy is what we're talking about. It certainly is the need of the hour. Mother Nature would be very happy, but it is also a concept that's picking up across the country. In Out of the Box this week, my colleague Samira has checked out a state-of-the-art home that consumes zero energy. <music> Hi, I'm Sheetal Rakheja, Partners in uh, Design and Development, which is uh, the main architect for this house, which is uh, being put across by 3C developers. This is a house which shows how a common man can live sustainably and contribute to the planet. Let me show you this house, which is called Shunya. As you can see, we have uh, landscaped the entire area around the house because it helps to reduce the heat island effect. The species that we have chosen for landscaping is all native plants and they consume very less water. The lights that you see are all solar lights. They run on the solar energy and do not use any electrical grid for their running. To offset the building footprint that the building has done on the uh, earth, destroyed the earth, you can offset that by doing this vertical landscaping. This not only helps to reduce the heat island effect, and if this is put against your building, it also acts as an insulation and reduces the heat which goes into the building. This courtyard in the center forms the heart of the house. The entire house revolves around this. It is not only a light well, as in it gets light, natural daylight into all the spaces of the house, it also is a beautiful view to look at, as well as it helps in natural ventilation of the house. All these windows that you see open into this court, so all the ventilation happens through this. The coat is shaded on top by these louvers which are adjustable. So during summers we can cut off the glare and still get in the light and in winters it allows more light and heat to come in. We have taken care that in the interior spaces, the material used are very environment friendly, like the bamboo flooring, the jute coir mat. This sofa and this uh, table also is an old furniture which we have refurbished and used. The walls have bamboo uh, wallpapers because bamboo being a rapidly renewable product, it's much better to use than wood. And uh, even the ceilings that you see is mineral fiber wood, which has a lot of recycled content in it. The paints used here are low in volatile organic compounds so that they are healthy for the environment, they are healthy for the occupants who stay here. is right now connected to our online BMS system and it is showing online what are the various electrical usages of the different systems which is consuming more electricity which is consuming less electricity how much power is being supplied by the solar uh, solar panels everything is being monitored so it helps the residents to notice and see what is happening in the house and if where all they need to reduce their electrical consumption so it is very very useful for them the 
this is just an example of what all can be done to save the planet how a common man can contribute to the planet the possibilities are limitless and endless even your own house you can make green by following small little things that we have done it may look small to you but they can contribute greatly to the planet There you go, certain good design ideas match it with great technology and what you get at the end of the day is a home that uses zero energy. Wouldn't we all like that? If you have certain green ideas of your own that you'd like to share with us and the rest of our viewers, all you have to do is pipe them across to us at our email ID, which doesn't change. It is propertymatters at utvmoney.com. And in case you'd like to revisit our earlier stories, revisit episodes, all you have to do is log on to YouTube. And if you're looking for something specific like out of the box, just put in property matters out of the box together and you'll find it there. With that, it's going to be a wrap on this episode of Property Matters. We'll be back again next week uh, with the country's best property deals. But until then, do take care. Bye-bye.